Hi, my name is Karthik Kanan and I am the CTO of Ally. Ally is the world's most accessible AI assistant used by hundreds of thousands of blind and low vision people every single day. Ally is built for people who are blind and low vision, but it's also for people who want to have a more simpler way of interacting with technology and using AI in their everyday lives. Ally understands the intent behind your question, picks the right tool to solve it for you, and gives you a response all in lightning speed. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what Ally can do today. And so let's dive in. So Ally has this really intelligent model that understands your query, interprets it correctly, and picks the right tool to go ahead and solve it. So I can just go ahead and ask questions like, hey Ally, do I need to carry an umbrella today? Well, it's going to be overcast in Rotterdam today with temperatures around 27 degrees Celsius, but it doesn't look like rain is part of the plan, so you might get away without an umbrella. Just another cloudy day, keeping us all in gray, as always. So, Ally is also very personalizable. So you can go ahead and tell it your favorite books. You could go ahead and uh, give it your dietary needs or prescriptions if, if you want to. Um, and Ally is able to give you a response uh, tailored to you based on that. Um, but another interesting thing is Ally can also look up the web for you. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how uh, Ally is, is, gives you personalized responses, but also looks up the web for you uh, and such, right? So I have a book here in front of me and I'm going to ask Ally to recommend books that I like uh, that the author could have possibly written. Hey Ally, could you take a look at this book and uh, recommend other book that I might like based on um, the author? Let me take a look. Ah, The Pier Falls by Mark Haddon. I suppose it's perfect for those who enjoy life's inherent tragedies wrapped in a well-written narrative. If you want more of his work, you could get his famous novel, The Curious Incident of the Dog in the Nighttime, which explores themes of mystery and human challenges with a deeply personal perspective. So in this case, Ally looked up the web for me to try and find other books by Mark Haddon. It kind of aligns with what uh, I'm looking for in Murder Mysteries, uh, but it also give, goes on to give me more suggestions uh, as well based on exactly what I like. So Ally is not just great at looking at what's around you and giving you descriptions and answering questions based on that. It's also very, very good at reading text. And not only does it just read text, but it also understands the layout of the document. So if the document has headings, if it's got tables, even figures or images, Ally is able to understand all of them and give you all text descriptions for them. So you're able to understand what's on the screen, even if you cannot, you know, even if you're blind or low vision and you can't fully you know, interpret visual information correctly. So with me in front of me is a menu from a restaurant and I'm going to have Ally scan this menu for me uh, and it's going to start reading it out, reading out, reading it out. And it's also going to you know, understand that the menu has headings and it's, you know, it's in the form of a column. So it will go ahead and read out the information correctly to me. So let's see. Hey Ally, can you read this menu in front of me? Let me take a look. Ah, the joy of reading menus. Let's see what this one has in store. The menu is for a place called N-Fuse. It's a lunch menu with various sections. Ah, starters. Includes options... Uh, hey Ally, uh, based on my dietary needs, could you recommend some good starters for me? vegetarian high protein options let's see what we have local green salad a classic starter you could ask if they can add some protein rich toppings like chickpeas or tofu the semi-dried tomato and mozzarella it's vegetarian though you might want to check if any extras can add a protein punch all right thank you one of my favorite features on ally is how it is how it's able to look up the calendar and answer any questions about it so you can give Ally access to your calendar and whenever you ask it a question about your agenda or if you have any upcoming meetings or if you just want to know if your calendar is free, um, you could go ahead and ask you know, Ally a question. Ally knows it needs to look up your calendar and looks that information up for you and then serves it to you in lightning speed. So I'm going to go ahead and ask Ally a question now. Hey Ally, uh, I'm planning to go on a jazz con go to a jazz concert on the 17th of june uh what does my agenda look like on that day in the evening uh do i have that free it looks like your evening on the 17th of june is free perfect for a jazz concert or any other frivolous escape from reality you might think of enjoy the music if you must so i just walked you through all the things i like and do today 
it can recognize things around you it can read documents it can also go ahead and access your calendar the web search and honestly so much more you can even play video games with ally and all of it is 100 percent accessible ally is not just an app on your phone it's available on ios and android but it's also available on the web and if you can if you want to have ally on glasses ally is also available on the admission glasses ally is 100 percent free and you can go ahead and install it today by just searching for ally on either your app store or play store or you could go and to www.ally.me and be able to use Ally on the web as well. So go ahead, try it out and let us know what you think.